All right, what is up, you beautiful people, and welcome back to the Blinded Brawl. We are playing some Swan today, joined here by Inflames. Let's get right to it, boys. Brawl modifiers, we have free Gary, free Dahaka, uh, and let me cook, boys. I'm going to mask Goliath. This can only end one of two ways. Mask Goliath with uh, the targeting lock-on is going to allow me to cook up enemy Dahaka and Gary at the same time. Or, Mask Alliance is made of paper, and I roll over and die. We're gonna find out, boys. What's up? Oh yeah, last Brawl modifier is a Void, so we have reduced vision range. So maybe Mask Alliance is not a great idea. But anyways, got enemy Dahaka here. Hit him with the Igor, baby. How dare you? Oh, he ate both my Goliaths! Uh-oh. Well, at least Gary uh, can't get hit by Dahakas. So Gary's gonna win this, fest, win this slap fest with ease. He's also being a little cheeky, granting us the income um from mid by just chilling out here let's uh get ourselves a beam so we can help out with the with the fight here yeah the beam will help mitigate like some of the uh will help will help us win like the hero battle a bit better because there's enemy heroes so the beam will you know focus fire them we're against, okay we're against this guy double the haka though kind of spooky if you ask me the haka i think that's actually not the worst matchup my Goliaths can can do pretty well into that. And there's a Phoenix. And like my tanks, tanks and Ares bots should just cook them up pretty nicely. So, yeah. Goliaths have decent DPS. Oh my god, they just got fried though. I think I just get some Cyclones. I'll get some Cyclones to lock onto his Dahaka. And then we'll get some tanks to lock onto his Ultralisk. And uh, if he goes Creeper Host, then, um, then we're kind of cooked. But, you know, what can I say? We can just have to mass Wraith and hope it works out. But let's see it. Let's see it. Stukov. Stukov action coming in here. Shall I level up? Yes, please. Four Goliaths is more than enough to win the fight here. Oh my god. But yeah. Guys, I'm so excited for the next, like, for the remainder of 2024 man i'm about to do stuff that like i've never done before yet again let's go aka move out with my friends i think i'm actually going to start like wanting to learn how to mix um some of my own beats because i'm like i think i've in like i've i've like listened to enough techno beats now to know what exactly kind of techno that i enjoy and i really want to make my own set now um but yeah okay my glad's getting eaten here i think i should have my i should have a uh, cyclones pull up a little later if that is the case, hit that E-Gorb here. Laser Beam gonna help me win this fight. There we go, boom. Oh no. Come on, Goliaths. Come on, Goliaths, do not falter. There we go, do not falter against the Xenos. The Xenos. There we go, let's get that here, let's get that there. Let's get uh, another one of these. Uh, I'm gonna put the Cyclones in the back because, uh, yeah. Let's get that Laser Drill upgrade so we can impact the battlefield right away. Should I get a refinery? Hell yeah, I'm gonna get a refinery. Nova going full Ravens is a very interesting play. But you know what? I've made more interesting plays than this before, so uh, we're gonna let them cook. Get the mag fuel accelerator. I should probably get like advanced optics as well, but like, oh, he's going for he's going for creeper host. My guy went for creeper host, baby. All right. Well. Creeper host it is. Creeper host it is. Against creeper host, I just gotta run him over. Like, that's, that's literally all I gotta do. Just run him over. Um, but the first initial impact is gonna be redonkulous. I'm gonna have to get like five. What the? Did you see that? That Goliath just got really big and fell over. Tell me you guys all saw that. That Goliath got real big. Let's get that here. Uh, I'm gonna get some Hellbats here so we can just pull up and like, you know, try and do an overrun. Swan's not really known for doing an overrun though, so yeah. And then Massing, oh my god, Ergo Zeta. Oh, that's the Dahaka I'm up against actually. He's gonna leg up. Huh. Okay. But yeah, Massing Goliaths maybe could work if I have like extended vision range and I can like see the guys coming in, but Goliaths are so fragile. It's like they have all the worst parts of um, of like a two by two unit and all the worst parts of a one by one unit combined. 
Like, they don't do enough damage for a 2x2 two two unit, I would say. And, uh, they also take, like, extra splash. I don't know. Oh, we got an Impaler. That's cute. That's cute. Okay. Oh my god, freaking Fungus Gnats. Bro, the Fruit Fly Saga has now expanded to the Fungus Gnat arc. <laughs> the, the sequel that we never asked for, boys. The sequel to the anime that we never asked for. <laughs> oh my god. Um, There's no point getting a science vessel now, is there? I don't think so. I think I should just rush tier 3 and get the, get the multi-lock so that we have some insane DPS coming out. So I can take down his Gary ASAP. And then I can take down his uh, the rest of his wave ASAP as well. Because without multi-lock, I think I'm going to be in trouble. Mm -hmm -hmm. But yeah. I think I'm actually on the cusp of building a life for myself. That like is going to be the ideal situation for me. Okay, there we go. Ooh. Oh, he has Aerial Burst Sack? Big mistake, boys. It's better to keep your Burst Sack uh, for ground units only. But yeah, like, I think I might be able to, you know, make most of my income off of tutoring and, you know, not have to work a real job. Technically teaching... Oh my god, Influence with the Alexander! Technically teaching is a... Uh, I want to say it's not like a real job in the sense that you don't have to... You don't have to deal with most of the politics and whatever that comes up with like, you know, when you work in the office and stuff. Um, or, or like stuff like that. And it's like relatively laid back. You just kind of... You're just dealing with kids most of the time. And if like, you know what you're doing, it's like pretty tight. So yeah, like even 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 my teaching jobs is like... Is, is relatively cushy. <gasps> Invisible Alexander. That's cracked. Okay, get the multi-lock here. Get the targeting optics. Oh my god. Invis Alex. Oh, baby. Targeting ops here. There we go. Get some of that extra range. Alexander is also going to absorb all the hits from that creeper host that he's got in the back there. Um. So yeah. It's, it's game ogre. It's game ogre, baby. And I have the multi-lock too, so like... He ain't gonna do anything. I got the lock on. Super Gary just getting pulled in real fast. Ooh. 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 Let's go, baby. I'll like upgrade my laser drill here. Multi lock. Yeah, Goliath multi lock is cracked. Uh, I think right now I just need more dudes. Some more Hellbats to just walk up front and like give us vision. Um. If at that, if we even need need it at that, Nova actually just gonna carry us with those Ravens plus the Alexander. That was a crack combo. Let's go. Well, I dealt the most damage. That's not surprising actually, because the beam is just constantly hitting stuff. But actually, it is kind of. Wait, how did Nova deal that much damage? Oh, I guess Nova actually built real units afterwards. But still, that's kind of insane that, like, the first two units were Ravens and stuff. Actually, I don't know. Raven supports not to be trifled with either. Um, there we go. That was kind of short, so uh, let's run another round. All right. We back. Let's run it. Um, I think this time around, I'm going to just rush Cyclones. Like, just say forget about it. We're just going to rush some Cyclones here. Um, ooh. We got the Raider. All right. All right. Let's go. I'm going to just run some Cyclones here. I don't know. Cyclones, I think, technically are the best. Like, just in a situation like this, you just can't go wrong with them. There's two hero units. Um, Glides were a bit of a gamble because uh, they are a late game investment. But once they start popping off, like, they're pretty good. I'm against the same guy. It's like Ergo Zeta again, but I don't know if he's uh, going to be playing Dahaka this time. Anyways, my Egorb here hitting. Oh, man. He hit me equally too. Oh, but I have health regen. There we go, baby. Get health regen done. This is why you always get health regen, baby. In general, it's going to be better. Unless, like, there's something to eat that's, like, high value. Health regen is pretty good. Ooh, okay. Uh, upgrade complete. I'm going to throw down a little laser beam to help tip the scales here. We'll upgrade the laser drill level. And then we can start getting some lock on. Oh, my God. He locked on to a Zergling. I cannot believe he's done this. I cannot believe he done this. I don't know what that sort of accent is supposed to be. I, I like. I just made that up. Um, blah 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 blah. blah. Wee. 
Uh oh, Cyclone expensive. Cyclone, why are you so expensive? I'm not gonna upgrade him. I'm just gonna gas up here. Uh huh. Uh huh. Oh, we got a railgun turret. Oh, we're against Nova. Oh no, we're so cooked. I have no real answer to Nova. I think I just have to mass Ares bots. I think I just have to mass Ares bots. Oh, we got a Goliath. Yeah, because Nova just like cooks me. Like Liberators can beat me up. Um, Nova tanks are better than mine. Uh. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Uh, okay, whatever. Let's just roll up. Let's just pull up with some Cyclones to start off. Um, technically, rates are actually pretty good up until like critical mass of Liberators have been arrived at. Critical mass of Liberators plus Ravens. Those two together just like demolish, demolish the rates. Um, just because Ravens have that AOE blast. Um, but yeah. Oh no, I can feel the effects of the caffeine wearing off. My speed boost is going down, guys. I need more caffeine. Eww. Shutting down. System down. System is shutting down. Uh, let's get some more intimidating roar here. Like, Cyclones can help me power through the ground. Um. Yeah, this guy went, this guy went and got a bunch of Goliaths, though. Well, to be fair, Nova can just beat me with her tanks. Um. So I don't know what I'm going to do here. I don't know what I'm going to do here. I know I'm going to gas, though. We didn't get that money. We don't have to get that money. Huh. I think we're just going to have to build a comp that can uh, carry. Or, like, carry against the guy we'll be facing. Like, if they push into us, I'm against Raynor. So, actually, tanks might not be a bad choice. Tanks might not be a bad choice. Okay, you know what? Tier 3... Let's pull out some Ares bots and let's get it done. I think I think we just have to Ares bot. Ares bot is weak against um, Hellbats, but that's what my Cyclones are here for. And uh, actually, Ghost deal bonus damage to them. There we go. Get that lock on, baby. Get that lock on. Yep, there's the tank. There is the tank. Actually, the tank might not be as effective because we have Dahaka. So, all hope is not lost. Um, Hellbat Ares bot. That's still not damage though. Like, I don't have enough, I don't have enough juice. You know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta be able to, uh, knock him out here. Inflame should be scanning though. I guess he didn't, he didn't notice, so it's okay. I got him. That's what my scans are for too, you know? Gotta help the team. Okay. Hmm. Not sure what to do versus Nova. So I'm gonna go Ares. There we go. Perfectly reasonable response. Ares bots. Uh, mm -hmm. Let's do that. Let's do that. Get some more healing here. Bomp, 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 bomp. Targeting optics. There we go. I probably get some Ares bots and science vessels and just be super thick. Um. Still, I don't think that's a good solution in the long run. Um, but if I can keep them occupied, oh, that's not it. That's not. <laughs> that's not. Maybe I should build rates. Nah, rates. I think kind of get shut down by the Goliaths because rates need to like kill stuff and snowball. Like as long as they're moving and they like blast through things, they'll do tons of damage. But Nova Goliaths have way too much health for them to like plow through them. You know. I think Swan Rates are basically just like light shock cavalry. Uh, if you guys ever play Total War, like you can uh, charge enemy units and like you know deal tons of damage on the charge, but if you leave them in combat, they will like completely just get dominated. Um, so yeah. Uh oh, we got some Marauders coming out. We're gonna get a little cooked. Um, let's see here. Do these Cyclones have less range than Ares bots? Uh-oh. That was not what I wanted them to do or be here for, but okay. Whatever. Ares bots are quite du quite durable. I'm just going to get a ton of them. Get some Science Vessels. Just be a big meat shield. And then, like, hopefully Inflames' is, in high power Rainer Wave. 
um, can carry the day for us. Because with some Banshees, yeah, that means nothing. Like, these Lurkers can't do anything. I got, I got my Laser Beam as well, so Inflames got that scan, so he can like, keep scan. Oh, maybe that's why he didn't have a scan up. He, like, out, he is, like, already, like, scanned out. Get some more armor here. We also got Tychus here. That's fine. Oh! Oh, that tank stayed alive for that long. I was like, damn, how's there a Nova tank here? And I, <laughs> and I was like, ooh, okay. Uh, should I upgrade armor? Nah, I'm gonna upgrade DPS on these Ares bots. Ares bots need more gas. They need more deeps. But yeah, having a, having a Tychus, like, help you out is, like, pretty massive here. Cyclones with their initial lock-on is gonna be pretty good. Pretty gas. There we go. And then Cyclones. Ooh, okay. Absorb that initial initial hit. I got some more Ares bots here. Yeah, I'm just gonna bot up, baby. I wish I could customize Ares bots. Like, if I could put, like, a flamethrower on them, put an anti-armor cannon on them, and, like, put, like, like anti-air missiles on them. That would be nice, because, like, I think that's what you could have done in the campaign for uh, Wings of Liberty with the Ares bots. So, I don't see why you're not allowed to do that here. I don't know. Seems arbitrary to me. Like, like I think Ares bots would actually be, like, the ultimate swan unit um, if you could do that. Because you could also just leave them in, like, the basic attack mode, um, which is, like, not specialized against anything. It's like, it's like, it's like Manx Boys, but, like, a bigger version of it, you know? You just gotta, you, like, when you upgrade it, it gets a new model. But then you can also, like, sell it back, so now Swan has the Swan Bank, you know? And the anti-armor missiles or something. Anti-armor grenades will do tons of damage. APHE, armor piercing, high explosive. Oh my god, there we go. Oh, he's got some ghosts to counteract my Ares bots. I, I don't know if ghosts are effective, though. That's the thing. They're definitely effective against, um... Oh my god, Firebats is getting massive here. Definitely, definitely effective against the uh, Hellbats, but I don't know about Ares bots. I, think, I guess they kind of counter each other, like Hellbats and uh, ghosts. Because uh, they both deal damage to each other, like bonus damage to each other. But I think Ghost Snipe is just too good, so... I'm gonna need more Hellbats. Ooh! The Tyka's Grenade plus the Egorb together is actually dirty. Like, Tyka's entire wave just basically survived intact. Oh, that feels good, man. Um, Kev is just crushing that cannon here. Let's go. Get some more armor upgrades here. Oh my god, my Dahaka's gliding. Get a Flame Breath here. Hey, bro, you gonna Flame Breath these nerds? I'm not going to do a lot of damage, but you know what I'm saying? The Banelings doing absolutely no damage because they jumped all of them. Just jumped the Haka, and we're just laughing here. Cyclone's being healed by... Ooh, Nikara. Ooh, Ares bot's getting taken down by the uh, Lurkers, though. But yeah. Yeah, like, Ares bots have, like, an anti-air... Actually, I guess Ares bots don't need an anti-air option because, like... Because <laughs> you have Goliaths for that job. Or maybe it could be, like, an anti-massive air option. Nah, that's still kind of an overlap. So yeah, like if you, had, if you had like a flamethrower option, I guess the flamethrower option also just means that like, why do you have that when you could just get hellbats, I guess. But then again, hellbats are kind of pp you know, they like just die too easily, so it's like, you know, you level up your hellbat into Ares bots. Yeah, I think, I think a flamethrower version and like an anti-armor version would be really nice. And then like, I guess there's no point in having a base version. Oh yeah, Aries bots was good, but I would say having uh, good teammates was even better. Um, because if we were evenly matched there, I think uh, I would have been in trouble. Banelings, I think, are the wrong choice for Stepman this week. Because there are um, tons of tanky hero units that can eat those Banelings and shrug them off. Um, so yeah, Banelings, definitely not the call. Definitely not it. Damage output, very high still. Uh, it's probably the laser beam. It probably is the laser beam. Just rushing like rushing like tier 3 beam. So good. Plus, I guess the cyclones are good too. Ares bots are just generally not a bad choice. Like, they don't get run over that easily. So yeah. Well, if you guys enjoy these two swan games, be sure to leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. In the rear with the gear. F*** the tires. Let's light some fires. They picked the wrong flight.